Hello everyone, welcome back for more Let's Play the Seventh Saga. So here we are in the Cave of Melanum. Off to the east, the Wind Room. So let's get going, shall we? And I'm pretty sure I know my way around here pretty well. Doesn't mean I won't get hit by enemies. You can defend. You can defend again. I am just not hitting, am I? I'm gonna have to start casting agility buffs on him just to make him hit. something interesting. Yeah, orcs tend to be hard to hit, but overall not a huge menace, really. Unlike the enemies which relentlessly Incredibly useful. And yeah, we're starting to take a good amount of damage here. Still going to save his magic for when I really, really need it. A potion three. So, let's break out some of these cheap potions we have. There we go. And now I gotta go back. Time to backtrack, since I can't get to the wind rune from down here. Another potion, aren't I? Hmm. Ah. Well, that was nice. It was nice. It may be time for me to grind some more soon. These enemies are not going down easy. That's what I have potions for. There we go. Almost to the wind rune. And of course, attack right before I can open up the menu. Just eventually, Lux was not going to miss. Way too many turns, though. That's the reason I think I might just need to grind some to get his speed up some. 
Okay, and we are about halfway through this first section of cave here. That wasn't so painful, was it? Only took seven minutes. I kind of wish I'd only hit them halfway, because them turning into that skeleton thing is kind of neat. I went the wrong way. I need to do a, I need to do the other The music broke up there for a second. Yep, I was about to completely bypass a chest. Although I think that's a to chug another potion. Kind of makes me wonder, how do potions heal a robot? I guess the same way enemies... Dead orc. Now, you may think it's taking quite a while to level up, but that's because when you have a partner, you only get Oh yeah, trick. That's why I was wanting to... That's why I used to ask people I love mirrors. I mean, we get a topaz out of that, and that's, you know, a decent chunk of change. But not really worth the soon... The, uh, pretty good chance of death. Definitely time for some healing. Oof. And the reason I'm using the potion ones out here is because, well, when you use the potion ones, they only heal 40. And I... what was I doing? And I would rather not have to try to heal 40 in the middle of battle. time when I used to play this game forever ago, I thought those were antacids. I don't know why either. And completely empty chest. Which allows us to get attacked. I guess I one. Yeah, we don't have any treasure chests to worry about in this section, but we will make it through the first thing. And we're going to get hit because all the enemies decide to spawn on this little trail here. Ugh. Balsu is not the stronger attacker. Maybe he just realizes that, you know, Balsu can heal. And now we are stuck here. So, Brantu, 
Earn your keep. So all you had to do was make those flash and the and the boulders moved, huh? Okay. Okay. Oh, Brand 2's gonna hide out around Brush, huh? Okay. Well, that was sure a cave thing. I think a 15-minute cave crawl is a good enough time to call it a video. So anyway, when we return, we explore the ancient ruins of Melanum. Maybe Lux will find out something about his ancestry. Who knows? Or does he even have an ancestry? I don't know. Take care, folks. See you later.